Hey guys, Sunny the Badger here. I know it's dark right now, but that's on purpose. Um, we are going to put a new LED light in for Mama Badger that has the turn signals built into it. So I'm gonna give you kind of a before and after. So this is with the old system on here. There's the tail light, there's the brake light. And there's the blinker. Okay guys, we've been wanting to do this for a while, but Mama Badger's bike, when we bought it, came with these little bitty LED lights that they use for the turn signals. You can see them on either side. And rather than going back to the normal stock setup, which are these big ones here, um, I am going to, I bought a tail light that combines everything into just the one piece here, uh, which basically would eliminate these. Another way that this would be helpful is a lot of people have to buy like a relocation kit for the standard turn signals to put bags and stuff on their soft tails. So this would be a way to do that without having to buy that. I think it's a hundred dollar kit and going through the labor of that. You could literally just replace this piece and cover it all. What's up everybody? Welcome to the Badger's Den and uh, a new series for um, the Badger's YouTube channel. Uh, I'm calling it uh, Sunday in the Shop. But basically most of you know I like to do um, all my own work and uh, you know sometimes I'm just adding new stuff. Sometimes I'm actually working on the bike. But for today, um, I'm actually replacing Mama Badger's rear light. So uh, I'm changing it to an LED light that has the turn signals built into it. So I bought this one off of Amazon. It was like $28.69. They had them for as much as $199, but I'm the cheap guy, so I always try the cheap stuff first. Uh, I don't believe you have to spend a fortune to get what you need done, done. So we're actually going to put this on Mama Badger's bike and give it a try. Uh, looks like it's a pretty easy install, which I'll go over with you guys. And uh, I've got some befores and the after, so you'll see kind of the full effect. This would also be a great alternative to moving the stock um, turn signals on uh, your soft tail if you're putting bags or something on it they do make relocation kits but even the relocation kits like a hundred bucks so this would allow you to basically take those off and uh, just use this so let's see how this goes all right guys so i got this box from amazon let's open it up it does tell you what wires right on the side it tells you what wires do what but uh, also um looks like it has an extra little padding piece here and then it already has all the plug and play clips ready to go so the white and red wire are not put in here yet you'll want to insert those once you figure out how your bike plug-in is set up and then just match them up and plug them in so pretty easy plug and play system let's uh, put it on the bike and see how it works just so you know guys it does have pretty detailed instructions Step one, step two, step three. And there's only five steps. So uh, pretty simple install. We will see how well it works. All right guys, so the first thing you wanna do is take the old tail light off. There's a screw here and a screw here. Uh, pretty simple and then this will just pull off. Let's get that taken apart. All right guys, so we got the screws out. You can see the tail light dangling here. There's the light bulb. There are your plug-ins for your new light to plug into. Um, and then you're gonna put your gasket right here. This one already has a gasket on it, but we'll probably replace that gasket with a new gasket just because this one is worn to this tail light. So let's get that unplugged and this all changed out and then uh, we'll see how it works. <sighs>
a little clip at the bottom of this. See that? It pushes and releases from here. Pull off this old gasket. All right, first things first, I'm gonna put on this new gasket. Make sure you don't cover up where you actually gotta plug in. So remember I told you that they didn't have these wires plugged in yet, and that's because this has four holes, but there's only three wires. I don't know whether you can see that or not. Now you can see the three wires. So there's the black one, which they already have installed. Then they have the red and yellow and the green. So the green, notice it skips one, and the green's in the very end. So you're gonna wanna do the same thing when you connect your new light. So it's gonna have this same setup. So look at what yours set, setup is and then match that with the new light. Then plug it in and see if it's working. So as you can see, I got the wires wired right. It is working. So always test it before you put it all back together, but everything seems to be working there. So I just have to plug in the turn signals and we should be ready to rock. So the box does tell you that the blue is left and the yellow is right. And there you go. I just turned on the right turn signal. And there's the left turn signal. So everything's working. Now we're gonna put it all back together and see what it looks like. It gave us nice, long, plenty of wire. All right, guys, so then you're just gonna put it back together. Once you've tucked your wires out of the way, um, just put your two screws back in and you should be all set to roll.
There you go, all done. Now these don't work anymore. You can take them off, whatever you want to do with them. Let's see what it looks like. All right, guys. So we got the brand new tail light in, all LED with the built-in turn signals. Let's see what it looks like. There's the tail light. There's the brake light. There's the turn signal. The other turn signal. Everything's working great. All right, guys, as you can see, everything works just great. Um, you also notice that there is the light up here to light up the license plate. Um, not a big deal, but if that's something you want, it's part of it. Um, so far, man, I'm pretty happy with it for $28. Uh, it does everything I need it to do. You can see everything nice and bright, and um, I don't have to mess with these little bitty blinkers anymore. Okay, guys, if you like videos like this, helpful hints, um, inexpensive fixes, stuff like this, um, definitely hit that subscribe button. Be sure you leave us your comments below because I answer them all. Um, I will put a link to what I bought off of Amazon in the description. And remember guys, it's not about the destination. It's all about the ride. See you next time.